I'm meeting some people. Okay. Awesome. Y'all ever heard about that old saying, loose lips sinks what? ships? Mm. Let's talk about it. So, if y'all have an enemy um, of any sort, the enemy, let's just say, is a spiritual practitioner. A spiritual practitioner will place all types of protection around her or read. She knows how to do that, right? Now, let me tell y'all how people think when they do work, right? They'll wait until the spiritual practitioner will get weak within their protection. They'll listen to clues. They'll listen to things you say. They'll rob your life to see what you are you know wavering on if is it your marriage is, is it your relationship is it your money or your finances is it your clients blah 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 this and that people will wait in the cut and wait on you to weaken so they can attack right in other words waiting until your guard is down yeah they do that right so this is where you have to always stay within protection works because people wait on you to weaken your forces in order to do what they need to do to place that downfall in your life. And this is why I never, never carelessly, carelessly expose my work to anybody. No, ma'am. See, this is why they say keep your spell work hidden at all times. Keep your spell um, performances secretive at all times. This is why. Because people wait. They are intrigued by you. They are curious about your life. And they also create, um, create things in their head and watch you. For your downfall y'all if y'all picking up what i'm putting down y'all better start sta staying more spiritually secretive with your words yeah. i mean i do this for a living but i would yeah. never give a bitch all oh, the map the um the maps to what i got going on i would never give you yeah. all of that because i know they be waiting in the lurk Mm. Food for thought. 